Hi guys, I just found out that today is the start of the Ferrandi dog sled race thing. I won't be here for the Iditarod start, so I thought I might as well show up for the Ferrandi start. I've never seen an actual dog sled race start, so I decided I should go. I should, I should find out where it is, first of all, and then um, see if I can find it and see if I can film sort of the sled dogs something that's sort of unique to Alaska, sled dog racing and the did rod, but like I said, I'm not going to be here for the did rod, which was lame. I was like kind of thinking of even going to Nome because I've never been there and getting the like end of the race, but I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, and Ferrandi is, I'm not really sure what it is. It's kind of like a, I don't know, it's kind of like a carnival. I, I mean, I know they set up like, I don't really know what it is, to be honest. But it's something that happens every year in the winter, and they set up carnival rides in a parking lot, and then they do like fur exchange type things, as well as, you know, the sled dog race. It's kind of like a state fair, but not as big and without as much food. Anyway, that's, that's what I can gather from it, but it's going on now, and let's see if I can find them doggies. Where are the doggies? So I think I found a place somewhere around here. 50, 20 minutes ago. Oops, to bring him home. Yes. And I'm expecting him to put a pretty good charge on at the end. Yes. So when we look at... I think they're uh, supposed to come down here. Right there blocked the off the street. The street. So I think that's the time. We had a chance, as we said, at the, at the, at the, um, at the bib. It's just these dogs are just kind of like washing on the street. So I don't know if you drive by a car usually. So far the only dog I've seen is that one. But it's supposed to come. Where are they? I think it's supposed to finish early though. But I'm going to say it's the lead snow machine that was the lead snow machine that the dogs were supposed to come see. We have a snow machine across the line looking for our first dog team to turn the corner pretty shortly. Let's see the finish line. So. Dog team on the corner. Dog team on 4th uh, Avenue. Here comes Early Reynolds, team number three, inbound. Oh, I see. Gavin Cook at the Gamble Culvert area. Dog teams making their way into downtown rapidly now. Here we go. Here we go. There they are. You see them through the box. Go, 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 go! 21-49. That's the king and the queen of Ferrandi. I was over there first, the first time. No, for me. For John Earhart, 89 43. 89 43. <laughs> so there you go. There's the fur part of fur rendezvous. <laughs> fur clad royalty, I guess. <laughs> so yeah, this is the middle of the track and the blue line that they crossed over there. There's the local news too. <laughs> quick, let up your camera quick. <laughs> They're coming, man. They're coming. The doggies are coming. Oh, he's, he's wow, that was quick. I, they're really on top of it. <laughs> Go, local news team.
team, number 12, Ava Ellis, back on 4th Avenue, about to cross the finish line. And dog team on the avenue, we got three teams on the avenue at the same time. They brought in all the snow on the street. Our streets usually don't have this much snow on them at all, so they brought it in for the race. <laughs> this is the last dog team. Oh! Oh, wow, these ones are actually huskies. Like, all the rest of them weren't husky looking dogs. Here's the map before they went the route they went on. Oh, the big rookie bit. Huh. It's very crude. Good <laughs> puppies. Thanks for coming down today. We'll see you tomorrow and have a wonderful Ronnie night. Look at his face. Good job. So this is the thing that they transport him in. Look, and their harnesses are back here. The sleds on top, and the puppies in the boxes. I don't know if I'm supposed to be back here. I don't really know how to get on the other side of that fence. There's no hole in the fence, so I'm walking probably on the wrong side of it. Ooh, these people are fancy. They got it. fancy metal dog. Oh, hey puppy. Good job. See you Shrek. Stick, Lodi, Penny, Salem. Oh, look, and there's a dog nose. There's a dog nose. Willie. Hi, Willie. Good job, Willie. Good boy. Hey. Oh, there's two dog noses. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry. It's an actual husky team. Hey, puppy. Hi. Swedish? Good boy. There's a hole in the fence. Aha! Okay. So I don't think I should have been over there, but I was, so that was cool. It is France, it is a keep de France. Print. Yeah. Oh, there you go. French, France, sled dog. Weird. Oh, puppies. Hi. They do rest. It says for the man who is everything. Oh boy. And this is what is what I call the Balto statue. However, on the plaque here, it does not say anything about Balto. If you would like to pause and read, 
And then about the sled dogs. It's right at the finish line. This dog. So here's the doggy statue. And there's the blue finish line. On the side. Yeah. Woof. So I hope you enjoyed the Ferranda dog race. Because I froze my butt off to film it. It's really cold today. So I crawled out of my nice warm bed, came down here to freeze, just so I could film it. And also because I haven't seen it before, even though I've lived here forever, I haven't seen it before. So I thought that was pretty cool. And the dog races in Balto is one of my favorite movies as a kid, so it's pretty exciting to see.